Canceled again today for school districts in Vancouver, Evergreen, Washougal, Battleground, Hawkinson, Ridgefield, and Longview as teachers continue to strike. Yeah, all the districts are offering teachers raises, but the teachers say they deserve a bigger portion of the millions of dollars the Washington State Supreme Court mandated be spent on those schools. Let's get to uh, Coins Elise Haas, who joins us live in Vancouver with the latest. Elise? That's right, Ken and Jenny. It's another day of canceled classes throughout Southwest Washington as thousands of teachers continue to walk the picket line instead of greeting students. And according to educators, the McCleary decision was to allow adequate funding for teacher salaries and the legislature provided the school district with $2.3 billion this year to go toward funding teacher salaries and special education. After taking several financial hits of no raises during the recession, teachers say they want their fair share now. And the school district and teacher unions are meeting face to face at the bargaining table to continue to talk over the proposals and counter proposals, but there is no sign yet that the schools will reopen soon. And for every day that this summer gets extended, the school days will have to head into next summer. Camas School District's first day of school is still scheduled for Tuesday, September 4th, right after the holiday weekend. However, the majority of teachers have voted in favor of a strike if a deal isn't met by then. The negotiations become pretty difficult because each district does its own collective bargaining and allocates money differently. Now, teachers hope that contract talks will not go on for weeks, but there's really no telling of what's going to happen. But some good news is, is that I talked to the Vancouver Teacher Union president, and she says that their bargainings are coming along, and both sides are working hard. She says that they have come closer in the past four days and in the last four months. So they're going to continue to talk over the holiday weekend, and we will continue to follow the status of the bargaining as well as school closures. And we'll bring you the latest on air and online. For now, reporting live in Vancouver, Elise Haas. Coin Six News. Thank you.